13.8 billion years ago. That's when the universe started. It started with the radiation era. There were eight epochs within that era. An epoch is a moment in time in which things change so dramatically that something new starts. There were six epochs within the very first second of time. The first epoch is called the Planck Epoch. It started when a tiny mysterious fireball appeared. It was so small it couldn't be seen. It was so hot, everything was pure energy. The Planck Epoch is named after a German theoretical physicist, Max Planck. Max Carl Ernst Ludwig Planck. Max Planck invented the Planck scale as a set of universal units based on the properties of nature. The Planck scale sets the universe's minimum beyond which the laws of physics break. Planck units can be extremely tiny in the case of Planck length or Planck time or extremely large in the case of Planck temperature or Planck acceleration. The Planck epoch was about one Planck temperature. That's 10 to the 32 Kelvin or 100 million, 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 million million degrees. The Planck Epoch was also about one Planck length. That's 1.6 times 10 to the negative 35 meters or 10 to the negative 20 times the size of a proton. Or to put it in a better perspective, if an atom is the size of a Colosseum, the Planck length would be the size of an atom. The Planck Epoch was also about one Planck time. Planck time is a time it takes a photon traveling the speed of light to cross the Planck length. That's 10 to the negative 43 seconds. During the Planck Epoch, the four forces of the universe were one, but the Planck Epoch was unstable and gravity broke free.